Hey y'all, it's Jayla aka Jay Chanelli on the internet. Welcome back slash to my channel if this is your first time here. Today is my very first day of school, going back to school. So if you watch my last life update, you know that I actually quit my job, my full time teaching position, and I'm going back to school, retaking some classes that I basically need to ace in order to better my med school application. So if you're interested in this day in the life of an older college student video, go ahead and keep on watching. Make sure you hit that subscribe button if you like videos like this, as well as beauty content, hair content, and other lifestyle content, okay? So hit that subscribe button. Also hit that notification bell so you can know anytime I'm posting a new video. All right, y'all, so y'all can see that I'm very much in my pajamas right now. It's about 11 a.m. I do need to go ahead and get ready so I can start this schoolwork. So let me go ahead and put on some clothes. All right, y'all, so this is the fit. Tie-dye on the top and tie-dye on the bottom. So yeah, y'all, that is the fit. I just put on a tie-dye sweatsuit that I got from Target and I still have my house shoes because I'm actually an online student. So again, if you watch my life update, you know that I was saying I didn't know whether I was gonna be able to get all online classes. That is what I was hoping for, which means I do not have to go to campus and you know expose myself to any potential COVID issues, okay? I actually am taking a total of three classes. Two of them are completely online, like self-guided, self-paced, and one of them is a live online class. So every Monday and Wednesday during the evening, I'll actually have to log on to Zoom for that online class. What I'm gonna do right now is get started on those two self-paced classes. I'll do a little materials haul for y'all in just a second. Okay, y'all, so let me just go ahead and show you my school materials. I don't have a lot. <laughs> you don't need a lot when you're taking online classes. So obviously, I have my handy dandy laptop. This is my laptop that I got literally in college. It is a MacBook Air 13 inch. I also purchased three subject notebook. I like to take physical notes, so I figured that would be helpful for me. I have my pencil pouch with all of my writing utensils and last but not least i have my bullet journal which of course i also use as a planner so if i need to write down homework assignments what i have to do for the week all of that is going to go inside of the bullet journal the only other thing that i might pick up is actually a graphing calculator because i'm taking a physics class i'm going to wait until the very first class to see if i really am going to need it or not i also made myself a cup of tea i don't drink coffee i drink tea so this black tea and mint is going to be the way that i get like my caffeine for today so yeah y'all let me go ahead and get started I actually need to do some things in my bullet journal first I need to set up like this week so I can write down all of my weekly assignments and when they're due so this is what August is looking like in my bullet journal so far and this is my August layout Alright y'all, so I've gone ahead and put down my assignments for the week in here. A lot of these like open today, but they kind of continue across the week. So I just put them all through Monday. I plan not to do anything on Tuesdays and Thursdays since that's my YouTube posting day. And I kind of want those to be work days for you. Alright y'all, so I finished taking my notes. These are based off of the textbook. I'm gonna let you know right now. I'm probably not going to be reading the textbook anymore because after I read the textbook, I then went through the PowerPoint. It's the exact same information. But those are basically the notes and I just finished taking my quiz. I got 100% on the second attempt, not on the first one, but the quiz was about like microscopes and parts of a compound microscope. I think that's all I needed to do for bio for today. Um, let me double check. All right, okay, I have a lot more to do actually for biology, I'm realizing. I have to go to the beach. It says you will set up an experiment in which you will objectively observe a species in a natural habitat for two hours. You want me to sit outside for two hours? Okay, 
this is a lot so just fyi i'm kind of waiting around right now because i need to install microsoft office on my mac i never used it on my mac i always use like google and google docs and everything but i figured since i get a free download and now that this laptop is strictly from my schoolwork i might as well go ahead and download it so i'm just waiting for that to download but it's taking a while in the meantime in between time the only other things that i have to do other than that whole observation situation which i'm not doing today i don't have it in me but i am going to go ahead and watch this this video if you are in college or in school you need to make sure that you have a video speed controller so that you can watch the video sped up you can increase the playback speed on YouTube very easily but if you have the extension any video you have to watch regardless of whether it's on YouTube or not you can control the speed of it and so example uh, non-biological example if we have a city that would be a system inside that we have a school inside that we have a classroom and so it's kind of like these Russian dolls with the larger ones uh, enveloping the small ones and so as we move through these hierarchy of life one term that I want you to keep in the back of your head is emergent properties in other words with each level as we get to a level there's gonna be a property or property hey, still there. waiting on Microsoft office to download finally have Microsoft Word downloaded onto my Mac sorry for the lighting situation it is about to storm I think we have like a I don't know if this is still the tropical depression, what, whatever. Getting ready to get started on my chemistry work. Posted everything that we need to do for the first chapter. And all of this stuff is due by Sunday because we have a chapter one quiz on Sunday. So I'm gonna go ahead and get started. All right, y'all, so I just made it out of my live lesson, which is my physics class. Definitely have a lot of work to do. I'm not good at physics at all, y'all. Like, it's not a strong suit. This is definitely the class that I needed to retake the most. But let me show you the notes that I took while I was in the live lesson. So these are the notes so far that I just took while we were in the live lesson. It's very basic stuff, but just stuff that I know that it's gonna get overwhelming pretty soon, so. So I'm not even gonna try to bother with that. I think I'm gonna go back to doing my chemistry. And then I think I'm also gonna take the grade quiz for chemistry which is due on Sunday but I might as well just get it out of the way so I'm completely done with chemistry for the entire week I missed one so I'm probably gonna retake it just cuz why get a 93 when you can get a hundred so that means that basically for the rest of the week I have to focus on that biology assignment and then really do physics because I haven't done anything for physics that's it that's kind of like the day in the life of me as an older college student being at home working virtually um, I feel like I got a lot done today hopefully this helps somebody if you enjoyed this remember to hit that subscribe button also like this video so that YouTube can share with other people. Let me know if you want to see more videos like this on my channel and I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye.